Hey folks, I wanted to make a quick video just showing how easy it is to make a Herbalife Formula One shake. It doesn't take much time. It's very easy. And if you've never done it before, you'd love it. It's, it's simple. It's, uh, you, it's very versatile. You can use different fluids. You can use milk. You can use almond milk. You can use water, whatever you want. I'm going to use my favorite 2% uh, pasteurized milk. It's from a local dairy and it doesn't have a lot of ingredients, just milk, a little bit of sugar, and chocolate powder for flavoring. So all I do, very simply, just add in about a cup chocolate milk, maybe a little bit more. Then I like to dilute it down with a little bit of water. Brings it up to about a cup and a half, and then I add two ice cubes. Just go over to the refrigerator, a couple of ice cubes, just to kind of make it a little cooler. Then you take your favorite shake, which uh, this is cookies and cream, which is really, really good. All you do is you take two scoops, one, two. You can shake this up, you don't have to blend it, but since I'm at home, I like to blend it up. Turn it on for about 30 seconds to about a minute, your choice. You can also add protein to this. So right now with the, the milk and the shake mix is 9 grams of protein. The milk adds about another 9 grams, so we're looking at about 15 grams of protein in this one shake. Um, tomorrow, tomorrow morning I'm in a 5K race, so I'm going to make this a recovery shake. And just to jazz it up a little bit, I'm going to use my Formula One Sport, which has got whey protein. The Formula One regular is soy protein. So I'm going to make my super recovery shake with my Formula One Sport and actually don't have a scooper so add one tablespoon again this is optional this is not your typical meal replacement shake so one scoop of that and then I'm going to add some personal protein powder that's going to boost the protein up even more so we're looking at about close to 20 25 grams protein which is it's adequate, it's good, it's good for recovery shape. Blend it up for another 30 seconds to a minute. Grab a glass and pour. So you see it's very simple, it's not complicated, it's not like making a whole recipe. I am not a cook, so I don't like to cook things. This makes it really easy for me to get my meal replacement and my recovery shake. I'm going to take a sip of it now and then I'm going to put it in the fridge and save it for tomorrow. Oh yeah, it's really good. Cookies and cream with chocolate milk and chocolate Formula One Sport. It is really, really good. So I'm going to shake this up in the morning after my race and uh, that's it. It's very simple. If you have any questions, let me know. Have a great day.